Hello friends, my name is BP Sharuka from Pratme. Today I'm going to talk to you about Neuro Linguistic Programming. What is all this about Neuro Linguistic Programming? As the name suggests, it consists of Neuro Linguistic and Programming. Now what does Neuro mean? Neuro means brain, mind, how we think. And Linguistic means what? Linguistic means the language of our mind a body and uh, what does programming mean? Programming means a sequence of actions to reach a desired goal. This uh, terminology has been taken from the field of computers and we will talk more about later. Let us understand how does NLP work in practice. Now let me explain. Let us assume that this is our outside world and there are various elements in this outside world <coughs> how many elements? over 20 million elements are there in our outside world when we look at it how are we going to look at it? we are going to look at it through our five senses what are these five senses? these five senses are our eyes which will visual this is a visual for the eyes or our ears they will hear the sounds or our tongue which will have the sense of taste our skin which will have the sense of touch and our nose which will have the sense of smell now these five senses are called in NLP B-A-K-O-G V is visual A is body K is kinesthetic O is olfactory and G is gustatory now these five senses are exposed to this outside world and through our brain we are able to make this projection onto our brain through a process which is a two stage process in the first stage first stage process filter filtration of information will take place information coming from the outside world to our five senses first, first stage filtration this is done through either deleting or distorting or generalizing the information and through this first stage process we will be forming our own internal world now I'll let me explain to you what happened in the stage 2 now in the stage 2 in the stage 2 we will be utilizing our identity our values, our decisions, our memories and our language that is our identity, our values, our decisions, our memories and our language, preferred language. Now through these second stage filter a new world will be made onto our mind. Now where is this new world made? This new world is made on our mind which will be <coughs> divided into two parts the conscious mind and the unconscious mind. So in the unconscious mind this outside world will be represented in different way 
then what it was outside. This is what we call our inner world as recorded in our subconscious mind or unconscious mind. And it will be having all the elements of the five senses. This is called a map. I will proceed further in my next video as to what happens after this inner world is formed. Thank you so much.